yesterday, last night, Sam and I were talking and we really want to do like a major upheaval on our channel. We want to do something completely different. Okay. Nick and Gabby went and shot the sunset um, last night and I don't know, it didn't really work out the way that he was thinking, but he's helping us and that's a big thing. Anyway, also, um, Sam said to me last night, "You, we need to like do better vlogging, do more vlogging, and I'm like, yeah, you need to like vlog, because I do the whole vlog. He doesn't even do any vlogging. I hate when I stop vlogging mid-vlog and then I forget where I left off, but I think I was complaining and saying that Sam was telling me we need to change some of the stuff that we do when we're vlogging, we need to make all these changes, and you need to vlog better. And I'm like, how can I vlog better? You need to vlog more. Anyway, um, so hopefully he will take that into consideration. Anyway, I stopped vlogging mid-vlog because Gabby fell off of the snow hill walking to school and they were just driving me crazy, so I had to stop vlogging. Anyway, I went down to the library already this morning and I didn't vlog it. And the reason that I didn't vlog going to the library is because when you're with a group of people and you're with your family and you vlog, nobody really pays attention, nobody really cares because you're with a bunch of people. But when you're by yourself and you're talking, First of all, people are like, wow, that person's talking to herself, she's crazy. But then you add the camera on top of that, people really think you're crazy. So I don't like to vlog when I'm by myself. I love this thing. Did I show it to you? Sophia bought it for me for Christmas. It's just like a scentsy warmer thing and I have some stuff in here, but I don't really like the smell. It's kind of berry-ish, I don't know. It doesn't smell as good as when I bought um, some candles, so I might go back to candles, or I might try some other smell and see if that if that works better. But anyway, I wanted to show you guys. You know how I'm always complaining that I'm freezing cold because I'm in Canada and Canada is a freezing cold place. Well, I've been making this thing. So it's kind of old-fashioned, but I feel like they're coming back in style. It's called a. I don't know what it's called. Can you guys see it? Wait, let me make it bigger. It's kind of like a sweater that goes over your shoulders, but it doesn't have any arms. It's just kind of like a, ah, oh, man. Okay. Anyway, that's what it is. That's what it looks like. But I don't know if I really like it, but I like the pattern. Ugh. Anyway, I'll show you. I don't like the color for sure. I like the pattern. It's really easy to work up, which means that the pattern is really easy and it works up really fast. So this is what it looks like. I'm just doing it in plain gray. It's so thick and so warm. So anyway, you put it on. This is just the bottom part. There will be like a, a top part. Anyway, you put it on and it just kind of goes over you. I don't know. How can I show it to you? Ma'am, I don't know. It's kind of like that, but it's crooked. Anyway, and then it keeps you warm. And I don't think I really like the neck the way they did it. I might do it like, like goes over my shoulders and then do it like this in the middle or something. I don't know. But anyway, I'm excited to finish it. I have this much wool left from a big, huge ball and then I only have this much left. So I'm either gonna have to go buy more wool. And that wool is like, I don't know, I've had that wool for a year. So I'm either gonna have to buy more wool or I'm going to have to change it up and if I do another part I might do it in black and it might be gray and black which I like gray and black together so that would work but hopefully I have enough wool. I'm getting ready to go get the girls in a, in a short while. We have like such a short school day. We get the girls get out like mid afternoon, early afternoon. Anyway I'm getting ready to go and get the girls and whoa the wind picked up. Woo! Wow windy. But anyway it is actually really warm outside today. It's gonna be plus six plus six, six above freezing. And this is what happens when it's plus six. There's like a, basically a big huge flood out here, but it's gorgeous. I can stand out here and I don't feel frozen. It's so nice. But look at these carrots are still here from when I fed the squirrels them. But look at the mess down there. I'm gonna have to clean that up. That's all squirrel food. They just make a mess. Anyway, the girls and I have been reading this book. I've been reading this book to them at night and we're on the last 10 pages. And last night we had like the last 40 pages to go. And they're like, please just read it, just read it. And I was like, all right, I'll just read it. But then we got down to the last 20 pages and it was 20 minutes past their bedtime. I'm like, oh my gosh, I can't finish this because they're gonna be a nightmare today. But they were okay this morning, but time will tell. Just washing the dishes here. Washing the dishes one-handed, but you can't do that. Anyway, um, 
Yeah, usually when that happens and they stay up too late, they are crying. My kids cry. They always cry. They cry when they're overtired. All right, you guys, I'm on my way to get the girls. I always vlog at the same spot, at the side of the house and at the bus stop, and sometimes not even at the bus stop because it can get really crazy at the bus stop. Like, all of a sudden there will be a whole bunch of mothers and everybody will be chatting and I just feel uncomfortable vlogging. Ooh. Anyway, it's windy and rainy. I don't know if you can tell, but it's spitting. And the wind actually takes away your breath. But here I am, standing outside in the freezing cold rain. Ooh, in the freezing cold rain, waiting for my babies. And I'm excited. I'm excited for them to come home. But I have been so tired this afternoon. Like, honestly, more tired than normal. The same thing happened yesterday. I don't know if it's because I'm not eating sugar. I don't know. I feel like it's not related to what I'm eating. I just feel like I'm exhausted. And I'm never exhausted. I always have a so I don't know what is going on. A lot of people are showing up whew, to pick up their kids, but they're all in cars. Usually people walk, but not today. Hi, girly. Yay! My mitts were too wet. Where are your mitts? Oh, they were too wet. What about your winter mitt? This fell off. Oh dear, we can fix it. So how was your day? Um, good. Nobody even knew what I was. We should have wore your helmet. We weren't thinking. Wow, look at that. Remember this morning that was all snow and now it's all grass. Woo. Wow, it's all soft snow now. Look at it. One day all the snow left. Okay, come on, let's go home before it freeze. We're home and it is so dark and dreary outside. I can't even get over it. It never rains in January. Ever. Do you guys do this? These are Sophie's. These are Sophie's leggings, and they fit her because they're the right length. She's really tall. The length fit her, but the width are really wide. So whenever she wears them, they fall down. So, oops. Every time my kid, and it happens to all of my kids. It happens to me. It happens to everybody. Our bum is bigger than our waist, baby. That's the problem. But anyway, so I sew them on each side. Oh, you did it today! Yeah. So I sewed them on each side so the waist is really tiny and so now they'll stay up. Oh, careful, there's a needle in there. Because I'm sick and tired of her showing her butt crack all the time. So anyway, what's in your backpack? What? So what's happening? Sophie is something super excited. I came home from school. You came home from school and what's in your backpack? What are you talking about? Come on, you got a surprise in there. Talking about it all the way home oh, from school. She got something hello, special. Hello. Um, we got the little pants backwards. Inside out. And backwards. We can wear our PJs, but they have to be inside out. Anything with there. Crazy. Have you ever had those days where it's just like a mishmash of everything? Everybody has something different set for supper? Sam made macaroni and cheese free macaroni and cheese for the girls one of their favorite lunches two thumbs I up eat them when they're hot do you like this hot is food not very hot. i know do you it's like medium hot do you like your food really hot mm -hmm. two thumbs up for you too is it charcoal no well no Yay, I need a charcoal. well it's funny because you i feel like you either love really hot food or you don't and gabby and i and my oldest son mark are the same the hotter my food is if it's burning my throat going down, it's yummy. All right, well, Gabby. Well, I can't have it burning down my throat or else we'll go into my, like my heart will get all hot and hurt very bad. And I'm having leftover ooh, cabbage rolls. It's not burning. Mm, I wish it was burning. I like cabbage burned. Burned. Black, a little bit black cabbage. Pops, Times like, like this when I... And I wish this that we had a microwave. Uh-oh, now it really this is burning. <clears throat> All right, well, we're doing a training course, aren't we? Training course? Uh, Who's first, course. Abby? No, Macy. Macy's and first? Okay, where do I have to stand? Um, where does it start? Like, right there. Where does it start? It starts over here, you go up. And All right, we're ready. Come in, Dad. So Macy doesn't like running. Macy, in! Do it again. 
Take two. That's it. Down. Yeah. Is that it? That was it? Alright, I'm gonna try it with Abby. No, she'll break it! <laughs> Alright, are you ready? Abby, get, get. Abby, go to, go to bed. In. Abby, go to bed. Oh, you're changing, changing the training course? Yeah. Come on up. There you go. Uh, this is how we do it. Uh, she got it. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> she doesn't have hey, a have you noticed this bird is screeching at me? He's so we screeching at me. Are you screeching? Are you screeching? Yeah, see, he answered me. He's singing. Are you talking to me? Go, go, go. Are you talking to me? Are you talking to me? He's not. He's singing. Oh. Talking to me. Well, the weather is amazing out. It's amazing. It's, it was like four or five degrees today. Raining a little bit. Really windy out. Yeah, really windy out. Hopefully we're gonna have a warm week this week. So I've been thinking about getting this camera. Well, I've been discussing it. We wanna to upgrade to a, a DSLR, but my concern is that it's gonna to be too heavy but it's gonna be a little bit clearer when we vlog, so. So that's the plan, and we haven't really decided what we wanna get. We're either gonna get a, a big one or a smaller one. What? New camera. Oh, I say same size. The camera. same size. No, The camera bigger, bigger. we're gonna get. Bigger, bigger. The camera we would bigger, get. Bigger, but lighter. The camera we would get would be like this big, <coughs> but a smaller Wait, one. Do you want a camera like that? Then I did this, but then it wouldn't go. Do you want a camera like that? Yes, but mom's doesn't work. Well, I'm going to get a camera like that, but um, it takes video. That one doesn't take video. Yeah. No, it doesn't take video. That's the button you press to look at their pictures. This is what's going on now. All that training and we got a tired little pup. Tired little pup. You tired? She's not tired. You tired, Macy? You tired, Macy? Oh, boy. And we've got some slackers here. And a big mess. Big mess. We're training them. So I have an idea. I have an idea. Are you ready? Kalina. Five minute tidy. Five minute tidy. It's five minute tidy time. Five minute tidy. Are you ready? Turn those off. Just that little Turn them off. We're going to have five minute tidy. And we're done. That was quick. That was quick. That was like two minutes. Not even two minutes to do all that Zero stuff. Minutes. <laughs> two Zero. minutes to do all that stuff. So I'm going to end tonight's vlog and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.